to the heaven. And this decision will be made at the time when they'll be breaking their fast and praying to Allah the Almighty. عن زيد عن زيد ابن خالد الجهري رضي الله عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم من فطر صائما كتب له مثل أجر الصائم لا ينقص من أجر الصائم شيء زيد بن خالد الجهري نرأيت the prophet peace be upon him said one who serves a fasting person and breaks his fast by giving him food. Allah the Almighty will write for him the reward, full reward of a fasting person. And this will not be decreased from the fast of a person who is being served. In this tradition, We know that uh, not only fasting is required, but it is required that should, sh we should feed the poor by fasting. We should serve some people who are fasting. If this person, a traveler, a man who is living without family, or a poor person who cannot afford good food, we can give him good food in the morning and day and down time. We can. We can call him at our house or we can uh, give food to him at his own house at dawn or by breaking fast in the evening. And feeding him for once means actually getting the reward of food one fast. I told previously also that uh, we actually learn in this uh, month to eat less and to feed more look after others more and to look after ourselves a little less. Uh, it's known that this is a month of charity. Ramadan is a month of charity. It's also known as Ramadan is a month of loving each other, looking after each other. Uh, here I will narrate one tradition uh, which tells us something about the superiority of the month of Ramadan. عن أبي هريرة رضي الله عنه أن رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم قال إذا جاء رمضان فتحت أبواب الجنة نرتد أبو هريرة May Allah be pleased with him He said Allah's Prophet peace be upon him said When Ramadan begins the gates of paradise are opened It's in Sahih Bukhari. There is another tradition in Sahih Bukhari which explains this tradition furthermore. And Abu Hurairah radiallahu anhu yaqul Qala Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Iza dakhla shahru Ramadan Futihat abwaabu s-sama Wa ghulliqat abwaabu jahannam Wa sulsilat ash-shayateen Narrated Abu Hurairah May Allah be pleased with him. That the Prophet of Allah, peace be upon him, said, When the month of Ramadan starts, the gates of heaven are opened, and the gates of hell are closed, and the devils are chained. It looks at Allah the Almighty starts favoring us. Normally he had uh, put us and uh, made to sit us in the examination hall given us equal e opportunity to do the good and equal opportunity to do the evil. It was our choice to do good or evil. But in the month of Ramadan, he slightly starts favoring us. He has chained the devil so that they should not uh, let, lead us astray. He has opened the gates of uh, paradise. He's closed the gates of hell. So that at least for this month, Allah the Almighty wants us to do good deeds and to mend our personalities. Thank you very much.